Okay, I think we are live. Welcome in, everyone. Welcome, welcome. So as promised, uh, today we are going to be playing three analog horror games. I'm actually really excited to be doing uh, three scary games again with you guys because I, I thought that the first one was really fun where we just kind of played three uh, three horror games of a, of all of a specific type, but I was really looking forward to uh, to doing this uh, to doing this again with you guys, and uh, this time it will be ho uh, analog horror related. So we will be uh, we will be doing uh, three different analog horror games. I don't know what uh, maybe next week we might be doing something a little bit different. Um, we might do I don't know what the theme is going to be for next week's one um, if we do three scary games again, but I think it's a lot of fun doing uh, three three scary analog games. I think uh, or for this uh, for this topic because I try and find a theme. Um, whenever I'm trying to plan out these uh, three scary games, because I don't want it to just be like three random scary games. I think it's a little bit more fun if uh, if we have like a a um, a through line for all of them. So welcome in everyone. Welcome, welcome. Hello Baxter. Hello Leah. Thank you for modding as always. Hello Tiny Ruler. Uh, hello Shibatan. I saw Shibatan was here earlier. Uh, Ian as well. Welcome, welcome. Uh, Solar Home Entertainment as well. Welcome, welcome. I do notice that this is your first, uh, your first chat. So welcome in. Thank you for stopping by. And Night Elf Danny as well. Let's go, let's go. Everyone, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. I hope you guys are having a great day today. Um, we're we're just gonna be playing. Um, I can't be here tonight. I have a lot of work. Uh, but I hope you guys have fun from Leah Dreams. Thank you, thank you, Leah Dreams. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you, thank you. Uh, and Estella, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Yes, uh, this today is going to be horror uh, or analog horror related. So I know that two of these games, so I've done a little bit of research before we get into these games. Uh, I did do a little bit of research into them. Uh, assessment Examination, which is this one, and uh, Lancaster Entity Exam are all are uh, like sort of, what is the word? Um, I'm going to have nightmares in this live. Yes, yes, yes. It's a, uh, I think that this, uh, a lot of these, these analog horror games are pretty freaky. Uh, these two though, assessment examination, as well as, um, what's the other one? Uh, assessment examination and, uh, Lancaster entity exam. These are both like, uh, almost like tests. So we're, we're going to be taking tests kind of similar to the upload I did a few days ago or not a few days ago. It was actually like a week ago, but, uh, that one was, um, it's similar to that one fear assessment. So I'm, I'm super excited to see what, uh, what this has, uh, what this has in store for us. I love playing these three scary games. I think it's a lot of fun. Um, I think next week's, uh, three scary games, it, I may not be able to find like a theme for it necessarily. So it might just be, uh, three random games that, uh, that I play on stream with you guys. Um, there's only one that's real. Yeah. These, uh, these, these analog, uh, and, uh, the last one that I'm playing as well, thought form is a little bit different, but I think it's inspired by the analog horror gray lock. Cause I think gray lock is the analog horror with the thought forms. I recently watched a uh, gray lock and it's, it's really, really freaky. Um, but I, I do enjoy it a lot. I'm actually going to turn up the volume a little bit on this, not too, too much. Cause I'm actually kind of worried because some of these get really, really loud. Um, so I'm just going to turn up the volume a slight, like, smidgen. Uh, if you guys need, if it gets too loud and you guys need me to turn it down, just let me know. Uh, and Omega Rando, hello, Yuki, welcome in, welcome, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. So we're, we're not, we're, we'll, we'll be able to talk and stuff during the Zatsudan section as always. Uh, but we're, for now, we're just going to uh, kind of jump in and see what awaits us in these analog horror games. Okay, let's just start. will now begin I actually need to turn up the volume on my end a little bit Friend, thanks for applying for this there we go at the authenticity assessment department all of us here at <laughs> are very happy to have you if you get the job that is today we'll be testing your instincts to see if you're qualified to perform authenticity assessments on your own in a real life scenario oh let's but go some we're gonna get hired guys required to get some more insight about who we would be hiring I really in, or I enjoy horror, but I keep thinking it's real. I don't think uh, I don't really necessarily think that any of it's real, but I do get freaked out by it. Uh, I'll put forth. I am drinking, so I'm sorry in advance. I'll try not to chat too much. No, isn't that more fun if you're drinking? Uh, how did you hear about this position? Word of mouth newspaper or newspapers or a dream? I heard about it. Let's go for a dream. I feel like that sounds more quirky. Oh, a. Oh, OK, there we go. Do you have any professional experience in this area? Uh, I mean, kinda. I watch a lot of analog horror, so yes, maybe a little bit. 
Do you experience any person or do you have any personal experience in this area? Yes or no? Wait, didn't I just answer that? Yes. Do you believe in God? Yes or no? Uh, is this is this a goofy odd dream? Yeah, this is a goofy odd dream. Uh, do I believe in God? I'm not particularly religious, so I'm gonna say no. Uh, do you fear death? Yes or no? Uh, I guess I don't really fear death. I don't know. What's the, what's the right word? What's the right word for this? Or the right answer? I guess there is no right answer. Uh, I guess, I guess, yeah, I guess I do fear death to some extent. Yuki encouraging. I mean, I, I think it's pretty fun. I would love to do a drinking stream sometime. That'd be really fun. Um, Goofy Audrey from the night, uh, from the nineties. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Uh, do you fear God? No, I do not. Do you have people you love in your life? Yes, of course. Do you fear losing them? Yes or no? Of course. In a moment, we will provide you with several images of people and you must determine whether or not these people are authentic and to be trusted or threats you should stay away from. Oh, okay. Be careful with your selections. Our decision on whether to hire you will depend heavily on your result. Oh shit. So we're actually guys, if we want to get hired, we have to we have to take this kind of seriously. Trust or threat. I mean, it just looks like a dude, so I guess trust. Drinking stream? Let's go drinking stream? Yeah, I would love to do ooh. This is looking a little a little warped. I would love to do a drinking stream. I think that'd be a lot of fun. Uh I don't know. Are is am I supposed to be detecting like an anomaly or something? Cause I feel like this looks okay. Uh I don't know. Alternates? Yeah, this is kind of like alternates. Trust or threat? Trust or threat? I don't know. Which one is this one, guys? Trust or threat? I feel like the eyes are a little uneven, but does that mean that, uh, what if they just have, like, what if their eyes are just naturally uneven? Are we being discriminatory towards them? No? Trust this? Tr trust or threat? Alternatives? Nah, yeah. Al alternates. Trust no one? Trust? Alright, we'll go with trust, maybe? Mm, I don't know, this guy looks like one of those, like, stockbroker type people that is gonna try and, like, scam you. I'm just gonna say threat. He looks like he's gonna scam me out of money. What is this? I don't even know what that was. What? Do I just say threat for everyone? Mm, trust or threat, guys. Trust or threat. Does this person look like a, a threat, or do they do they look like you can trust them? Trust. Ooh, this looks freaky. Okay, that look. Someone looks like their eyes look like they were sunken in or something. That was freaky. Uh, this just looks like a person. Oh, this is definitely a threat. Oh, what the fuck? What is this? Abraham Wallace. Uh, I can't even read this. It says... Tablet take three by mouth nightly. I have to, like, look at my, my feed on, uh, on OBS in order to tell what this is. We're getting the lore sprinkled in, guys. This just looks like a dude. This just looks like a normal dude, so I'm gonna say trust. This just looks like a lady. Nothing looks uh, suspicious about them, really. I'm gonna just assume that it's really obvious. Well, I think... Is she missing an eye? I think she's missing an eye. Why are we judging people by their looks now? She By Shido? Welcome in, Shido. Welcome, welcome. I don't know why. Uh, I don't know what this one is. 
did Alex Kirster make a um uh, make this game? I don't think he made this one. I'm gonna say threat because their eye is looking a little alternate. This just looks like a lady. I know the perfect game is called Hooked on a Hooked on a Day by Daylight Dating Sim. Okay, uh, Francisco es Estrada, a uh, 19 victim to police, uh, police department. What's your emergency? Yes, hi. I'm at uh, Do uh, Dore Park at a ga at a gas station, actually in a corner. Uh, uh, Dore Park, I think, or in the corner of Dore Park, I think there's somebody, uh, somebody here who needs help. There's a, a kid outside. He's got blood on him. Yeah, I can't read this fucking font when it's like blown up like this. I can actually kind of read it better on my feed when it's smaller. Is he hurt? I don't know. He looks fine. It's just he's outside the door is, or and the door or he's outside and the door is locked. So I can't tell. He's asking for help though, so I don't know if I can uh if I can hear, but he's asking me to help him. Okay, I'm dispatching an ambulance right now. Is there a way for you to unlock this door? Oh, I can unlock it for sure. I work here, I have the keys. Then what's stopping you? Well, I mean, I wanted to help him, obviously, the moment he came in. It's a kid with blood on him, for Christ's sake. But this is gonna sound like crazy to you. Just I was pulling out my keys, I saw it. His face. His face, you know, he had this look. It reminds me of something, I don't know what. Something is I'm terrified of. Fuck, I don't know, man. But something's off about that kid. Like, real off. You're gonna let this kid bleed out because he feels off? No, that's not what I'm saying. He's he's not dying. I don't think he just didn't look right is all. Kid looked like he had he just died himself, but he hasn't, obviously. He looked like a ghost or a demon. It's hard to explain. Maybe I'm just fucked up right now. I've been drinking a little bit, but you uh, you had to see him. It's scary shit, officer. This sounds like a super professional call right now. Officer? He must be pale because of blood loss. Poor kid can't even keep his eyes straight and not because he drank uh, one too many cheap beers. Damn, roasting this person's character. Is he still there? How does he look? Uh, yeah, he's... I don't know. Um... I'm like crouching under the counter, so I can't even see what he's doing. It's fucking creepy. Hmm, okay, well, the ambulance is is a good 20 minutes away, and the kid cannot be doing well, so I need you to go assist him. Oh, fuck that. No fucking way. No, you didn't see that little fucker. He's not normal. Shit, dude, this is so unhinged. Damn, what the fuck? Uh, you know refusal to cooperate is a crime, right, son? Is, is that what that is? Of course. Fuck, fuck, okay. I'll go check on him. Only when he's being threatened. Thank you, I'll stay on the line. Alright. Uh, Ave... Avenue Maria Santa... Santa... Uh, San, Santissima? I think that's how you, how you say that. Ooh. Oh, is, is that the kid? Hey, yo. Ah, uh, I think that kid is a threat. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that. I, I'm, I'm agreeing with this dude, even though he's had a couple beers. Dang, that would be scary IRL though, right? Alternatives be like in games. Yeah, that's this. Okay, threat. We're going to go threat. threat they're all a threat oh this one this one's more normal or is that the, is that how they're gonna get me do you get the, do, do you get good survival instincts trust he prayed in spanish damn if you are accepted into Ooh. receive a letter on Okay, that was loud. Next. Bro, this expression looks like about to murder someone. Don't judge a book park. when your mouth is full. Admire the tall and beautiful trees all around, or watch as some of our little ones grow. Bring the kids along. They'll have a fantastic time in our new play area. 
There is truly no better place to make beautiful memories. Dore Park, one of the county's most lovely locations. Oh, yes, lovely location. Look at it. So beautiful. Only we got some weird fucking entities walking around. I can see his pain. I see it from my window. See it every night. I can hear his steps. I hear them from my window. Hear them every night. You might want to get that checked. For the, our father of many, his tears taste of sacrifice. His steps carry guilt. I swear, if there's going to be a loud ass jump scare, I'm going to lose it. His steps carry guilt. Why haunt this one park? Why torment my dreams nightly? Does he fear nightmares? So is this, is like all this related to the park? I see his pain. I see it from my window. I, s I can see it's fake. What does AAD stand for? I have no idea. Maybe the company we're working for? Or we're, uh, we're, uh, we are, um, what is it, interviewing for? I won't sleep tonight. Won't listen to the man's steps or I will be next. Excellent. You have now completed the authenticity assessment examination. Awesome. Congratulations. If you are accepted into uh. you will receive a letter on April the 23rd at 10.04 a.m. Awesome. We're hired, guys. The letter arrives before that. Stay inside. Lock your doors and windows and wait for the real letter to arrive. What? Do not call the police. What? If the real letter does not arrive and you believe in a god, pray to them. If they are real, hope they will take pity on your soul. If everything goes well, however, we'll see you very soon. We'll be thrilled to have you join our ever-growing family. You have reached the end of your examination. What? What is going on? Okay, so if we... Holy shit. So, if... We have to just stay inside and wait for our thing? The real letter, right? What? Shit, okay, well, damn. Alright, well, that was pretty fun. I feel like there could have been maybe a little bit more. I didn't really know what the lore was. I don't know if there's an actual uh, analog horror related to this one, but this one was pretty fun. This one was pretty, pretty spooky. So, we... <laughs> the real letter don't stay, right? What is that? That is... What are you waiting for? Do you guys hear that? What are you waiting for? Like, th dude, that is so freaky. That sounds like Mandela. That sounds like Mandela catalog. All right, well, that is it for this one. We will be moving on to the next one. So let me go ahead and get the next one loaded up real quick. This one's going to be, I think this one's going to be good. I think this one's going to be a fun time. Let me go ahead and get it loaded. Okay, so... Which one is it? Okay, there it is. All right. Oh, wow, it's so big. Hold on. Uh, I need to make it smaller real quick. Give me just a second, guys, while I go ahead and get this loaded up. There's like an angle or perspective to this. I don't know how to... Uh... There we go. Okay, I think that's good. And then I also need to do this. Where is it? Uh... Hmm. Where is it? Where's the audio? Come on. Just a second, guys. Yuki Scuff? Yes, Yuki Scuff going on right now. I'm trying to uh, to get the audio to work. There it is. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Okay, I think that's good. Okay. All right. All right. I think we're good to go. So this is Lancaster Leak Entity Exam. I think this one will be actually really scary. So this is the next analog horror, uh, the next analog horror one. 
So we will be, I think everything's working. Let me make sure the audio is okay. Yeah, it sounds like static. Good, good. All right, I think we're, I think we're good. I think we're good. I think this one's going to be extra, extra scary. This one's going to be really, really weird, I think. So we are, we are back. Um, we are back to, we are back to it. So let's just, let's just jump into this one. I think this one's a bit longer though. We are getting the feeling that you aren't taking us seriously. Oop, there we go. No acknowledgement of missing Valerie or the tapes we are, are we will leak. This time we will decide to reveal something a little bit closer to home, an old screen recording of one of your training protocols. If she isn't a uh, if she isn't released, maybe the next leak will show you how useless your training is. Does this agent body cam footage ring a bell? Let's go! Let's go! This one I think is going to be really good. ERD! Entity Research Department! Let's go! We're getting, we're getting hired, guys. Login user. Okay. Um, there we go. Okay, required learning modules and practice quiz. Zero of six completion, face detection, situation training, doppelganger detection, and image recognition, audio transcription, entity 101. This is our new job. Yes, we are. And then we have an exam. So let's just go to face detection first. All right, let's do it. Let's get it. Throughout ERD research, there has been one constant. You guys are the password? Yes, you guys are the password. Entities who possess human characteristics are the most violent, deceptive, and are the greatest threat to public security. Entities? What are what are entities? It is imperative that agents have the skills to not only like uh, SCP containment breach, bad. like that sort of thing. Damn, guys, we went back in time. Look, it's 1991. One year fatality rate goes down? What? I don't know if I want to sign up for this company, guys. The AI voice, right? All right, here we go. Face recognition. Easy, easy. That's a face. Ooh. Okay, some of these are kind of actually freaky. Ew, what is that? Hello. Yeah, I think I would. I think I think it's time to uh, put in our two weeks. Oh my God, what are these? Oh. Oh God. That one. Hello. This is some pretty freaky uh, images. I think this is AI generated. Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah. Okay, face. There's a face there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What the fuck? Yo. Oh, shit. Uh. Yeah, we passed. Uh. Okay, situation training. Woo! All right, that was scary. That was pretty scary. This module has been created to address and rectify observed deviations from established protocols, reaffirming the essential principles that all ERD agents are expected to adhere to consistently. 
Uh, the Sir Oreo, welcome in, welcome, welcome. We are currently playing Lancaster Entity Exam. Thank you for stopping by. I got jump scared so hard, right? I would cry for real. This is this is our values that we have to that we have to um, terminate self. What? These are the the protocols we have to follow as uh, as agents. Second, eliminate the threat unless such entity is on the preservation list. A dead entity can be studied, a dead agent cannot. If fighting back is futile, agents should run. If running is futile, agents should terminate themselves. Okay. An example, the company comes first, am I right? The principles of CDRT. Company comes first? In 1989, Agent Redacted was collecting data on Entity 59 Skinwalker. Suddenly cornered, Agent Redacted fired all 12 shots of his service pistol into Entity. With no bullets left, Redacted was subjected to Entity 59 as rep. Remember to not the self-termination. An extra round. This video is another example. Think, following the values of search, what would you do? Uh Oh, good god. Okay, yo, we're getting uh we're getting the found footage uh the found footage treatment. Uh Is there something following him? What is this? Ooh. Oh god. Ah oh, shit. Uh lesson 2, do's and don'ts, improvements we need in the RD. To interact with entities, if new data can be collected, don't risk losing obtained data by interacting Damn, too much. what? Do help co-workers gather data. Don't become friends with co-workers. Okay, so no becoming friends? So we can't make friends, guys. Data. Don't hesitate. Explain later. Do terminate co-workers who leak data. That's what? Yo! We're allowed to terminate our co-workers the if they're if they're leaking data? Co-workers and data collection. Assisting civilians is strictly forbidden unless stated otherwise in mission protocol. Reminder, the punishment for deviation is termination. What is this company? In 1990, Agent Redacted was on a mission studying an entity. The entity was located at Agent Redacted's house. Agent Redacted tried and successfully saved his wife. Agent Redacted didn't follow protocol and both him and his wife were terminated. Because he helped a civilian and didn't collect data. That is nuts. That's crazy. We will not remind about these topics again. See your supervisor if you have questions. What if I can't trust my supervisor, huh? Then what? A multiple question. Oh, great. Here we go. Topics will now commence. Guys, I'm so bad at taking tests, I swear. I hate Begin. test taking. Oh god, here we go. Uh, an entity has killed your partner, but is no longer exhibiting hostile behavior. What should you do? <laughs> killed your partner. Uh, collect evidence is the first one, right? Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We just... It, it killed our partner, but that's fine. We, we gotta get the evidence now. Ooh, hello, Cheshire Cat. Uh, after a mission, an entity unknowingly followed you home. You have tried to shoot the entity, but your efforts are futile. You are cornered. What should you do? Uh, you are cornered in your room. Terminate self, right? We gotta, we gotta off ourselves. Yes. Give your, you have self-respect to give yourself a painless death. Uh, you're carrying, carrying newly discovered data about an entity. You hear your partner upstairs cry for help. You know you could probably neutralize the threat attacking your partner. What should you do? Um, run away, right? Because the data is the most important thing. We got to get the data back. Do not risk losing data. Yeah. You have 
a do not interfere order on a mission studying an entity. The entity is killing civilians, one of which is your friend. You have been given a weapon strong enough to neutralize the entity. What should you do? Obviously, we have to be the shitty person here. This is like Cards Against Humanity, guys. Obviously, not the one that sounds right. We obviously record your friend's death for data. <laughs> Follow the mission protocol, right? There we go. That's it. You overhear your superior talking about a plan to leak data from ERD. You are worried that you will be in trouble for solving the issue. What should you do? Um... Do, do nothing. They probably know something you don't. Terminate your boss. Record conversation. And report your boss. Or ask your boss to explain the con- Terminate your boss! Obviously. Do not hesitate. Every second you don't terminate is another second data could be leaked. There are no there is no punishment for something. This job sounds like a load of junk to BH. This is this job sounds crazy, man. What the fuck? <laughs> Trust no one. Okay. Doppelganger detection. You can't trust anyone. You only can you only can trust yourself. Backstabbing is the name of the game for this one. This is like Game of Thrones. Doppelgangers, let's go. Taking, taking, selling your soul to a company seriously, right? Special training on doppelganger detection was created. Originally thought to be its own entity type, the doppelganger is rather a class. Doppelganger? I mean doppelganger? Mimic humans. Doppelgangers can be detected from their abnormal features. The Yo, all three of these look the same. Skin, all three of these kind of just look the same. Features. Further classification of the Bellbangers. Loose skin? Oh, on the ears. Okay, okay, features. I see. What if someone just looks like this? What if someone just lost an eye? Are we discriminating against people who lost eyes? Using your cursor, click on the doppelganger amongst the humans. Ah, great. Okay, here we go. Begin. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. Oh shit, we're timed. Uh, this one. This one. Dude, I swear, some of the some people just look like this. Loose skin. Uh, this one? Okay. Whew. Loose skin. They're skinwalkers. Oh shit. Their eyes are, are, are fucked up. Uh, oh, uh, this one? This one. Better be a good payday? Dude, we better be getting paid a shit ton for this. Oh, fuck me. This one? Okay. Whew. Some of these I can't even tell. This one. This one. Okay. Some of these I have to release. I need more than like, what? 10 seconds? Oh my god. What, what if that person was just wearing a mask? Yeah, 15 out of 15. Let's go. Man, this reminds me of school. I don't like taking tests. It reminds me of when, uh, when you're like staying up, uh, like you stay up because you have a test the next day and you can't sleep. Reminds me of that. Image recognition, audio transcription, and entity 101. It's not normal. Uh, it's normal to not have eyebrows the fuck, right? That's what I was thinking. What if we're just being discriminate? Like we're just discriminating people. What if they're not actually an entity? This company needs to reevaluate its, uh, its its categorization for for people his training module is to practice i get test anxiety same doesn't sound like a government job i'm thinking private industry or no what if i have a what if i don't like rubber duckies is it then a threat the pay would be worth it i hope so i hope the pay is worth it what if i really don't like rubber duckies what if that's a threat to me oh fuck me no threat Uh, threat. Yeah, that's a threat. I mean, technically not a threat, but 
Okay, there's no one here, so no threat. Oh, hello, you're a threat, sir. A uh, threat. Man, I hate this. Come on, don't time me. I don't like being timed. Threat. Why does it take forever for a picture to pop up? Right? That's what I'm saying. Come on. Threat. Uh, no threat. That looks like the area Kaneki was being held in in Tokyo Ghoul. Oh, that's a threat. No threat. Ooh! Yikes! Okay, come on, come on. No threat, no threat. Okay, nope. Nothing. Alright, empty, empty door. Doorway? Cool, cool. Another empty doorway? Abandoned building? Ooh, okay, threat, threat, threat. Threat? What? Ew, what are these? Oh, Silent Hill looking ass. Uh, no threat. Oh my god, the images are disappearing. Freddy Fazbear, Chuck E. Cheese, Freddy Fazbear, whore, 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 whore. Oh god, uh. No threat. Oh, threat, 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 threat. Oh my god, the images are disappearing. Fuck. No threat, no threat. Oh, dude, this is bullshit. What is this? Okay, that's a threat. That's a threat. That's a threat. Uh, no threat. Dude, the images are flashing on screen for like half a second. Okay. I don't know what that was, but it looked... Okay. Woo! 30, let's go! It's like that meme where it's like, what are you guys going to get on the test? And then it's like, I'm going to get a hundred. I actually got a hundred. Let's go. Oh my God, man. That shit was intense. I hate being timed, man. Okay. You have like one second. Yeah, you have like half a second. You have like, if you blink too fast, you're going to miss it. All right. Fuck this. Let's go. Audio transcription. This test is crap. This test is bullshit. Agents must be able to accurately transcribe audio coming oh, great. from usual sources. Dude, I cannot listen to stuff. Besides being able to detect incoming attacks, agents must document what entities say during encounters. Dude, what do we need? What is this? What are the job requirements? I can only imagine that the list is long as shit for for to get into this company. So what you hear and press enter when complete. Ah, fuck. All right. Time to uh begin. Open up my my ears more. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy river. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Oh, lazy dog. There we go. Okay. Got it. Do not look behind you. Do not look behind you. Okay, these are actually pretty easy. We got this. We got this. Don't look behind you guys. You are weak and replaceable. Damn. Maybe to the company we are. You are weak and replaceable. They're really, uh... Subtle, subtle, uh, like. Clap, 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 cloudy. The chance of rain. Oh shit! Uh, they're really s slipping in the uh the subliminal messages. Cloudy. With a chance of rain. Let's go. Everything is fine. 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 
Do I do the everything is do I have to, do I have to type in the fine 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 fine? Or is it just like the one? Okay, it's just the one, okay. What? Okay, can you repeat that? I don't see this that often. Where's the background noise? Wait, what? I don't see this that often? Don't leave me here. Don't leave me here? Okay. Did I do a typo? Get out of my eyes? Get out of my eyes. Get out of my eyes? Ugh. Get my What was that? Okay, hold on. I'm actually gonna turn down the volume because it looks like it's getting kind of loud. What? What is that saying, huh? You're right, Robert should kill himself? What? What? You are right. Robert should kill himself. Nope. Okay, I got that one wrong. Aaron, it's me. I'm home. Oh, what are these, man? What the fuck? Are you kidding? Guys, hold on. I need to turn up my audio like all the way because I don't understand this shit. What? I don't know what are what are these mumbles, man? I don't even know. I'm gripping my headphones a little. Right? What is this? What are these saying? Something about playing with me? Oh my god, what? Dude, this static is making it worse. I can't hear because of the static. I came to play with you? Okay, thank you guys. Don't you forget me. Don't you forget me. Okay, okay. I desire you. Okay. Do I type in the so cold twice? No, I do not. Okay. Okay, rap is that you? Stay back. Stay the fuck back. Okay, woo! 
We got it. Ears. Ah. Oh. oh, God. Oh, God. My ears. Ow. Ow. Oh, God. This is the worst one by far, man. This is so bad. Oh, shit. Oh, God. That is awful. Okay, what is this one? Entities are otherworldly beings that humans have been encountering for thousands of years. For once was a I turned on my audio too. Okay, I'm gonna turn my audio back down. I edited it a hundred percent when that happened. More rapidly through time. God this damn, I hate that one. That is an awful part. test. The RD goal is researching entities to protect the public, but more importantly, finding utility in entities and where they come from. The leading theory of where they come from is backdoors, yet no physical evidence has been found yet. Okay, so we're getting the lore on where they're coming from. That s where you come in. As an agent of ERD, you will be conducting highly confidential research missions to explore the. I don't think I want to be a part of this company. I'd like out. Their origin. This brief module will explain how entities are classified and show you the four entities the RD are focusing on in 1992. I think I'm good. Entities are given an ID but are often given a nickname. Oh, what the Some fuck? Threat level, containment, utility? A family of entities. Entities are classified in three ways. Threat level, containment, and utility each rated by five levels. Ah! Uh, oh, look! It's my sleep paralysis demon. Look at him go. Class, doppelganger. Threat, How is that a doppelganger Extreme. of anyone? Extreme. Utility, significant. Shadow people or night terrors torment their prey during nights when there is. It's just a sleep paralysis demon. When the prey is sleeping, paralyzing their prey during sleep. Shadow See, look, it's a sleep paralysis demon. It is known why shadow people choose to kill, as they will often torment the same subject for many years. But when they do, the victim is in touch. They spelled threat the wrong. It says feet in instead of threat. The research goal this year is finding out how shadow people choose their prey, and if this can be influenced. If so, E549 could be used in advanced interrogation techniques. I fall in love with my sleep paralysis demon to scare them away? <laughs> what? Entity, E718. Nickname, Look, Metronic, it's Freddy Fazbear. Whore, 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 Utility, whore, 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 whore. take the form of animatronics, playful figures that appeal to children. Metronics prey Dude, this is literally just Freddy Fazbear. It is a Yo, this is just FNAF. Their children pray. However, they are never seen again. Matronics, although dangerous, they are easy to terminate and capture. The past five years, agents of ERD children have been targeted Still says the instead of threat. Taken 107 to date. The research goal this year is finding why is that William Afton? targeting agent children and how to redirect their targeting. Freddy? Yeah, dude, that's Freddy. That's Freddy Fazbear. E59. Nickname, Skinwalker. Class, nah, dude, danger. what do you mean, Threat, Skinwalker? This deer Contain just looks like it's got moderate. barnacles on it. Utility, significant. Freddy from another Skin universe? Yeah, I guess so. Shifters usually taking the form of animals and uncommonly humans. Nah, dude, this, uh, this deer just has barnacles on it. Skinwalkers are incredibly violent and when killed leave behind nothing but their body vector. Skinwalkers have a hard time replicating the natural movements of creatures they take control of. Skinwalkers can often be identified by unusual eye size or loose skin. The research goal this year is finding a systematic way to identify skinwalkers 99% of the time and... Zombie deer? Nah, I just got barnacles on it. ...can be taken to prevent loss of possession of body. I don't know if you guys know, like, but... Barnacles kind of remind me of, like, the, uh... E59. Ooh. The the rake. Class, no. Threat, moderate. Containment, moderate. Utility, low. After the elimination of the Windigo, a new creature has seemingly taken its place in the Midwest of America and Southern Canada. 
humanoid in shape. The rake has varying size limbs, but usually can all you get all you guys that live in the United skin. States and Canada, Rakes good luck. And good luck. Are their favorite prey. Rakes are susceptible to barnacles. Fire. Barnacles yeah, remind me of uh, the uh, the trypophobia the thing with like the 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 holes. The Those are barnacles remind me of. After the wind in eradication. Is there a point of taking the creepy pasta? I think so. I think this is. A brief quiz will now begin. Oh fuck. Okay. All right. Time to uh to get ready. Begin. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, rake. Ah, uh, Freddy Fazbear. Uh, shadow people. It looks like the Cheshire Cat. Uh, Skinwalker. Man, I hate these quizzes. Rake! Dude, that's literally William Afton! Oh wait, a child of an agent has been taken by a Matronic. What should you do? Oh fuck, I don't know. Capture? No? Uh, what gives away this entity is a skinwalker. Upwards figure. Dogs don't walk on their hind legs unless you train them to. Uh, shadow people kill their prey after how long? Fuck if I know. Uh, I wasn't paying attention. One to three days? Nope. The rake has approached you in a mission. All you have is a pistol. Are you able to terminate the entity? Yes. They are fragile. You have a child and after watching this training module, you have learned your child is at risk of abduction. You should... Do nothing. <laughs> Stick to the mission. That's literally Springtrap, right? Hey, yo, 8 out of 10, let's go. It's still passing. Okay, next. Alright, now we have the, uh, the exam, right? Let's go, okay. Exam time. Let's let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get it. My dog stands up on her two front legs when she pees, and it's funny. <laughs> okay, guys, we're gonna have to lock in for this one. Begin. Okay. Base. This one. Did you check the latch? Okay, we're gonna have to be. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to try and figure it out. Running the train. Welcome in. Uh, has an entity uh, threatening appearance. What should you do? Collect evidence. Collect evidence. Uh, no threat. No threat. Yeah, the one on the right. Right. The one on the right. You encountered a Matronic during a mission. Are you in danger? No, collect data. This one. Oh, what the fuck? Terminate. I mean, I only got one option, so. Looks like we're terminating self. Dude, that's just Mickey Mouse. What the she knows I go to Aratagai? Uh huh. That one's obviously not right. It's Mickey Mouse. Shadow people. That's a shadow person. Uh huh. Uh, your coworker considered you a good friend. Seems to be infected by something. Wants you to save him, but uh, this is an example of. Do not befriend coworkers. Are you serious? This is actually kind of stressful. Ooh, face, face, face. We gotta pass, guys. Face. Mickey Mouse stream? I don't know if I can do the, uh, the, the voice for that long. What was that? I don't even know what that said. Uh, no threat, no threat. Uh, threat, 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 threat. That's a threat. 
A group of entities have kidnapped children. You have mission protocols only to observe from a distance. What should you do? Observe. We should only observe. That's a rake. Just don't give me any more of the ones where you have to listen, man. That's just so hard. Base. Did we pass? No. Uh, some people just look like this, guys. This isn't... Dude, that's Ronald McDonald. What? Let's go. Oh. Wait. Uh, wait, what? Pass? Yeah, we pass. Let's go. Yuki does a pretty good Mickey. Uh-huh. Thank you, guys. Considered... Oh, never mind. Okay, this is just an ad. Well, we did it. Let's go. The Lancaster Leak TBA. Alright, well, we did it. Let's go. Are we being hypnotized? I don't know. Alright, well, that was the next one. So now we have the last game that we will be playing for today. Let's go. That was pretty fun. Pretty fun. Um, Platform Invasion... Um, okay, last one is Thought Form Invasion, which is based off of a analog horror called Greylock, I think. Now Yuki's gonna get haunted by the company? Am I? I don't think so. I don't think the company wants me. I don't think, uh, I don't think I'm the, the person they're looking for. Okay, let's make sure that this is working. Awesome. Okay, properties right here. Okay, now I just need to get the, uh, on. where is it? Where is it? Greylock is so good. Yeah, Greylock is really freaky. I'm trying to get the, uh, audio to work. Okay, I think that's it. Let me see. Okay, yes. Okay, I think it's, I think it's working. All right, let's go. All right, last game, last game. Night one. Try to sleep. Let's go. Oh shit, uh, press E to open eyes. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my God, this reminds me of the rinse and repeat one. What the hell? Aw, oh, dude, this is so freaky. This is literally sleep paralysis, demon. Uh This is a this is a good one. This is better than those uh test taking ones. Gotta try and sleep. Uh not if the sleep paralysis demon's gonna get me. I can't sleep. Look at how small that TV is. How are you seeing that? How are you seeing that TV all the way from here? That TV is so fucking tiny. Like, I'm gonna be squinting so hard to try and read the subtitles on the TV. Do we have to listen attentively? I don't... I don't know. I don't think... Not like the last one where it was like, oh, you need to listen and... Okay, uh, maybe I stand corrected. The last one you had to listen so fucking closely to try and get it, it was actually ridiculous. Okay. Oh wait, we have battery? What is this? Another FNAF reference? What the fuck? Yo. I can't believe we have battery. I just noticed that. I'm covering it, but we have battery. Oh god, not the creepy soundtrack. 
Fuck. Why don't we close the blinds? Uh, hello? This is actually really scary. FNAF 4? Yeah, kinda, right? Oh god, I can see this getting really scary. You fell asleep. Oh god. Isia, welcome in. Continue night two? Okay. Just wasting your own battery? Light scares them. Oh, okay, so this is how... Oh man, dude, this is actually like terrifying. Oh god, dude, what the fuck? Light terrifies them, terrifies- this is- this is gonna terrify me, dude. I'm gonna be trying to sleep and this shit's gonna drive me nuts. This is actually gonna give me nightmares. Five nights? Do I have to survive five nights? Oh, what the fuck? Yo! Oh, good god. I didn't know I was playing FNAF tonight. Oh my god. Oh shit, dude. This is actually really scary. Yeah, I didn't know we're playing FNAF. Oh, good god. Uh, I'm at 75% power. This is so hard. I bet our character is like, well, I guess I'm playing FNAF when I'm about to sleep, when it's nighttime. Yo, it's about to be midnight, so watching this is freaking me out. Yeah, have have fun falling asleep. Okay, okay. Luckily, it's still light out here, so I think I'll be... Oh, okay. I think I'll be all right. Why do you keep popping up? Go away. All right, 63% power. Uh, this shit is freaky. Come on, dude, it takes so long for us to fall asleep. Go away. Oh my God, what the fuck? He's still there. Listening to the sounds in the room, I guess. This is literally FNAF 4, right? Nope. Come on, come on. It always like defaults back to the uh... I'm having a cozy night. How can you? Oh God. How can you sleep with this? Guys, I'm not going to be able to sleep tonight. Okay, okay. Oh, I hate the sounds. Oh, you bastard, you absolute bastard. Oh, can you fuck off, sir? This is so scary. FNAF 4 ripoff? Nah, man, this is scarier than FNAF 4. Okay, whoo. We fell asleep, let's go. This is way scarier, this is more realistic than FNAF 4. All right, night three, let's go. Ignore noise. Okay, so we can't listen to noise. Shit, is it getting, I think, or is it getting more blurry or is that just me? Mm. Fuck. 
fuck. This is terrifying. Ignore noise. Ignore noise. Ignore noise. Ignore it. Ignore it. I don't want to get jump scared, man. This is a jump scare game. I hate jump scares. Ah, God. Oh, God. Oh, the thought forms materialized. Oh, God damn it. Oh, oh man, I hate this. That's annoying. Okay, come on. That actually got me. That scared the fuck out of me. It's always this motherfucker over here. Ah, shit. How many nights? I have no idea. Can you fuck off? I see you there. Dude, how can you fall asleep if you're just like constantly opening your eyes and like turning on the flashlight? Can we just count the sheep or something? Dude, our power gets eaten up so quick. See you there. It takes so long. <gasps> oh, what the fuck is that in the closet? Please, please, please. Oh my God, I hate that, that dude. I don't know if we're gonna be able to sleep, guys. Oh, I hate this. This is so dumb. Oh, hello monster in the closet. Oh my god, they're so active. Yo, this is harder than FNAF. What? Oh, he's right there. We're not even halfway. Ooh, look at that painting on the wall, actually. That's really gnarly. That's really gnarly. We're at 50% and we're not even halfway asleep. Fuck this game. This game is absolutely awful. And I think our progress reduces. Can you fuck off, demon? What an asshole. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Jump scare, please. No, no jump scare. No jump scare. Come on, come on, come on. Please just let me sleep. Just let me sleep. Oh, fuck this game. Come on. Can we at least get halfway? Oh, two at the same time. Ignore the noises, ignore, ignore the noises. This game is hard as fuck. Yeah, I think we're, I think we're fucked. We, do we really, it says ignore the noises, but should we actually like listen out for them? You can, can pull uh, the helicopter trick. I don't know, man. Can I? If the ghost comes towards me, I'm going to piss on it because I'm going to piss myself. I'm at 22% battery, guys, by the way. T3, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. I can't do this anymore. I'm scared. Yes, this is so scary. What the fuck, man? Oh, I hope you guys have sweet dreams after this game. Ignore. Ignore the noises. 16% power. Fuck off. Come on, please, please, please. Oh, hello. Oh, 
come on, please. Dude, what the hell? Joke's on you, it's noon for me. Let's go. But I do know that people are, will be sleeping soon, so good, uh, sweet dreams to all you guys. <sighs> Come on, man. I have to sleep after the stream. <laughs> good luck, Estella. <sighs> Go away. Please. I'm at 1% power. I think I'm fucked. Yeah, I don't think there's anything. No! God damn it, dude. I hate that. Ah, oh, the thought forms materialize. Fuck. Are we just psyching ourselves out at this point? I feel like we're just psyching ourselves out. Ah. Oh. Okay, we're going to listen. We're going to listen to the sounds. That is not funny. What are you guys talking about? What do you mean? I'm doing my final uh, final year project and watch the scary stream. Yes, I hope you're having a good time. This is uh, this game is pretty freaky. Uh, pig deer. Oh no! Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. I'm Yukimaru, and currently we are playing three scary analog horror games. Thank you for stopping by. Oh man, come on, just let me sleep. We're gonna do it in like increments, all right? We're gonna we're gonna wait a bit. Okay, okay. All right, all right. Are we good? Is this? This might be the strat. Okay, okay. Go away. The closet one, dude. What is the jump scare for that one? Oh fuck. Hello. Why does he have no face? Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're at 81% power. 81. Okay. Whenever you whenever you turn the power on, it gets harder to fall asleep. Come on, please, please, please. Like it, it, it reduces your, your progress that you've made. Come on. Ah, there he is. 73% power. In the power management game, what? FNAF, Freddy Fazbear. Oh, I love, I love being able to not sleep. Ah, oh, this motherfucker. Come on. 67% and we're halfway. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. If there's a fifth night, I'm going to lose it. I'm actually going to cry. Okay, okay, okay. My hands are sweating, guys. My hands are literally sweating. Human Freddy, right? No, he's like Springtrap because he's he's peeking around corners. <sighs> this asshole. Okay. I'm going to get the worst sleep ever after this shit. Ugh, go away. It's okay, you can sell it to us. This motherfucker. Come on, please, please, please. Go away. The the noises, the Ooh. It's getting harder to fall asleep. Oh my god, 40% power. This motherfucker's so active. Go away. 
I think that the what is it the uh the noises the outside I don't think that I think that's just there to trip us up come on 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 just let me sleep just let me sleep I swear to fucking god just let me sleep just let me sleep hate sleep paralysis demons I hate them I hate them This is the longest. It's going slower, guys. Are you kidding me? Just come on. This is the longest shit ever. I swear. Oh my goodness, man. Come on. 17% power. One, two, three, four. Ah, you bastard. Come on. Yes. Oh, we did it. Let's go. We fell asleep. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Oh my God. There's a fourth night. What the fuck? Yo, come on, man. Come on. Listen carefully. Oh, come on. That's some bullshit. Five nights? Okay, so listen carefully. Okay, listen, listen. Alright guys, listen up, listen up. Okay, okay. I'm listening. I'm listening very intentively. What the fuck is that microwave going off? Who's cooking in my kitchen? What fucking thought forms are being... Get the fuck out of my house. What are you doing? They're cooking in my kitchen. That's crazy. Making themselves at home. That uh the faceless dude, how's he gonna eat if he has no if he has no mouth? Oh my god. Come on, come on. Bed breakfast for Yuki? Oh, how sweet of them, how kind. I hear the fucking floorboards creaking, dude. Come on. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, Lord. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. I hear footsteps. Oh, there he is. Oh, why is his neck so long? Ah, uh, you're making a mess in my kitchen. They're making a huge mess in my kitchen. It looks like skibbity. What the hell, right? Actually, you're right. Fuck. Come on. Oh, Lord. Oh, I hate the sounds in this game. Ah. Uh, I don't think we're gonna make it. We're at 47%. Come on, come on, please. Stop sitting on my couch, asshole. Get out of here. No, not don't listen to the microwave. The microwave is a is a bait. Yeah, okay, so microwave isn't anything. There's so many sounds. Ah. Ignore the footsteps in the hallway. Right? 
Come on. Come on. Oh, fuck. Get out of here, Skibbity. Oh my goodness. I hate footsteps. I hate the footsteps. Oh, and Skibbity too. Oh, fuck. I'm at 19%. I don't think I'm making it, guys. Come on. Come on. Nope, that wasn't anything. 16%. Oh, it's so active. Oh, what the fuck? I didn't even hear him. This is the the microwave one. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. The microwave one makes it to where I can't hear him like sitting down on the on the couch. That's sabotage. That's bull. That's rigged. That's not fair. Oh shit. I'm at zero power. Hi! Oh god! Oh, I fucking hate you! Ah! Oh. God damn it, man. That's... Oh, come on, man. Not cool. Not cool. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna listen. I'm gonna listen. We're listening very attentively. Okay, no. Okay, okay. I'm holding my headphones right now. I'm listening. The jump scare woke me up. Okay, okay. Okay. Skibbity. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. I'm gonna go sleep now for real. Thank you for the stream. Good night. Thank you for stopping by, Estella. Oyasumi, Oyasumi. Okay, there he is. There he is. Can't get me, can't get me. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, oh, you bastard. Come on. We're halfway, we're halfway. Ah, monster in the closet, monster in the closet. Ah, damn it. Damn it, dude. Can you fuck off? Let me sleep. Oh wait, no, that's outside. Picking nice clothes before jump scaring Yuki? Yeah, my clothes. Those are my clothes. This is my house. Is he making a mess in my kitchen? How fucking rude these uh these guys are. Come on. 
Oh, fuck. I hate that it detracts your progress. Okay, okay. Go away, go away. Forty nine percent, forty nine percent power. Oh, I, this is so hard. If there's one more night, I'm going to lose it. Can you go away? Thank you. Hello. That's outside. That's not inside. Can you go away? I don't know if we're going to make it, guys. I don't know if we're going to make it. Not if this guy keeps popping up, we're not going to make it. Oh, they're so active. Come on. Twenty four percent, twenty four percent. Oh, yes, we did it. Oh, 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 we made it. We made it. Oh, let's go. No, there's a fifth night. Come on, man. Come on. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, come on. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, listen. Oh, there's even less that I can see now. It's even darker. Hello. You got we just have to believe. We have to trust in ourselves. Ten nights? No way. There's no way there's ten nights. You guys are lying. If there's ten nights, I'm stopping at five. Oh, God. Oh, God damn it. Fuck. What is that one, man? Oh, you bastard, man. Where's that one? Ah, oh, shit. Ten nights? They tried to double up on FNAF? No way. There's no way there's ten. Ah. Uh. Smash? You want to smash that thing? I don't know. He looks a little freaky. Hello. Skibbity? Okay. Easy, easy. No, no. You can't trick me into using my battery. No, I don't actually know how many nights. Okay, okay. As long as it's not 10. Ah, that's outside. That's outside. I don't think there's anything outside, right? Does anything come in? I have to be kind of quiet so I can hear. What is that? 
What is that noise? There's, there's five nights according to the game link. Thank you, thank you, riding the train. Let's go. So we just have to survive this one. Oh, fuck. Just one more, just one more. So one more night. Last night. Let me sleep. Oh. oh, what is that one, man? What is that one? What is that one? How do I counter that? That is awful. That is awful, awful, awful. Okay, I think I'm not supposed to, maybe I'm just not supposed to look at him. See? See? Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Sleep paralysis demon, don't listen to him. Only, only check when there's noise. Only check when there's noise. We, we just can't check. Yeah, okay. Oh, there he is, there he is. Ah, oh, you little bastard hiding in the window. Cheshire cat. Looking ass. Nope. Okay. Okay. Nope. That's not nothing. That's a fake out. This is the hardest game ever. We're at seventy nine percent battery, though. I hate this jump scare, guys. I'm turning down my volume. Actually, no, I can't turn down my volume because if I do, then I can't hear anything. Logo for my favorite band, the cat, and then the cat. I don't know, man. He just looks freaky. All right, time to listen. This shit is so hard. Ah, uh, come on. We're on the final night, too. I don't hear anything. The one in the window is really hard to hear. Oh, wait, nope. Fuck. I'm extra paranoid now. I can't fall asleep. The longer we 
keep our eyes closed, the faster we can fall asleep. But... If they're super active, there's nothing I can do. Fuck me. Oh. Okay, yeah, window, window. Yuki is tripping? Nah, I'm just, I'm gaslighting myself. Nope. No. No. Wait. Oh. God damn it. Oh. I hate this game. I can't even say anything or do anything. I have to just be quiet and listen. Uh, all right, we're going to try it one more time. If we don't get it, it is what it is. This shit is hard. I'm listening.
Yes, we got it. Okay. Whew. Okay, we did it. We we did it. We did it. God damn. It says info average playtime is 25 to 35 minutes. I love how Yuki is over 40 minutes in. Dude, that was that was so hard because you have to like actively listen to everything. You have to listen to every little thing it's doing. Okay, we made it. We did it. We did it. Okay. We're done. We we're at like 1% power, but I was like, no, 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 no. All right, I'm going to. That is it. That was the last game, though. We did it. We did it. So we're going to move over to the to the Zatsu room just to uh, just to kind of hang out. Oh, here's Isia's art again. <laughs> I forgot to uh, I forgot to take it down uh, from last time. But oh, man, that game was so intense because you have to listen so intensively. That game is really like FNAF 4, though. And FNAF 4 is one of my least favorite ones because I have to listen so uh, so closely to it. But we did it. We did it. Let's go. Let's go. I can finally uh, I can finally sleep easy now, knowing that we knowing that we did it. But let's go. Woo. OK, OK. So, yes, we 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 don't really have any other announcements or anything for the for the rest of the week. Uh, we have Faith later this week, which is uh, another RPG style game where you play as like a priest or something like that. And it looks really freaky. It looks really scary. So uh, FNAF but skibbity, right? Yeah, that game was so intense. That game was really, really intense. But I hope you guys enjoyed the three scary analog games. I will be going back in and adding in the uh, the the timestamps for all of them. So if there's a specific game you guys missed that you would like to watch, I will be uh, I'll for sure be adding them adding them back in. So concentrating on i5, dude. I had to. I had to concentrate. I had to just like be quiet and just listen because the the one with like the smiley face, it's literally just a tap. And this one, they were on that final night. They were so active too. So it was also really difficult, but um, yeah, we, we have uh, I don't know if I'll be able to finish a uh, faith in one stream. We're going to try to I the the playtimes kind of average around like they, they're very the, the playtimes are very different. Um, they they average like from like three to four hours. So I hope I can try and finish finish it in one stream, but I'm not too sure. But yeah, that game is going to give me nightmares for sure. So that god damn, dude, I was, I was concentrating. I was locked in so hard trying to uh, trying to win it. But uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So also, I'm going to try and figure out what games we're going to be playing next week. I think I might just do observation duty. I think that'll be pretty fun if I just kind of play an observation duty game with you guys on uh, on Tuesday. I think that'll be I think that'll be pretty fun. So um other than that no other announcements or anything just kind of hanging out and chilling we will um we will be playing faith though i think faith will be will be a lot of fun so i hope you guys enjoyed the three scary games i want to i want to try and plan what the next one will be i'm kind of thinking maybe for the next three scary games if i can't really get a topic going for it the way i had analog horror for this one i'm kind of thinking of just maybe just streaming like three random games that you guys suggest and uh and just kind of going live and just kind of hanging out and playing some random games. Observation Duty, yeah, yeah. We played so many other Observation Duty related games that we haven't really played Observation Duty on stream, so I think that that could be pretty fun. I'll probably be playing six though. I'll probably be playing uh, Observation Duty six. So I don't think there's anything else though. Anything else to announce? So I will be getting ready to. Uh, you really forgot about the corpse party? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Because the last cor the last the last few corpse party uh, chapters are going to be really, really long. So I'm kind of uh, they're going to be they're going to be difficult. Yeah, the last the last two chapters are super, super long. They're like, I think it's I think it's from anywhere from like four to six hours or something crazy like that. It's really, really long, though. So um, we'll get to it. We'll get to it eventually. Um, he's done with it i i do plan on doing it at some point just and and, and then in the in the, what is the word and not in the uh not within the next week or two that's for sure because i'm not i'm not ready to sit down and uh and get a, a lot of lore heavy stuff because i think it's also too you have to like uh you have to your choices matter more depending on what endings you get and that shit is that, that's gonna drive me crazy if i if i mess up six hours yeah it's long it's a really long the last few chapters are really long i think it's like six hours each for each chapter 
or something like that. So that's why I'm uh, I'm a little intimidated to do it. The first few chapters were OK because they're pretty short, but the the last few are going to be uh, are going to be pretty long. So. But I don't think I have any other announcements other than that, though, guys. Thank you guys for sticking around and, and watching. I hope you guys had a good time. I had a pretty fun time playing these three scary games. I think the next three scary games, though, I might just be uh, scary games, uh, three random scary games and, and just doing it, doing it that way. So but until then, I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys here on Saturday for Faith. I hope you guys will tune in for that one. I think it's going to be a really long, not a really long stream, but probably like a three to four hour stream. And I think it's going to be a roller coaster because it's very uh, the game is very scary and very lore heavy. So I, I hope you guys will tune in for that one on Saturday. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Done it.